You are watching Only Downtown on GTV3. Hi, I'm Gary Means. And I'm Tasha Stevens. And we're with the Lexington and Fayette County Parking Authority, and we want to welcome you to Only Downtown. Have you ever pulled up to one of these old-style single-space meters and not had any quarters on you? Well, we, we know that happens a lot, and uh, we think we have just the idea for you. How about a single-space meter that accepts credit cards. That's right. We're in the middle of a 90-day pilot program where we're testing out these meters and they accept credit cards but work at a single space uh, setup like the old style meters do. Um, we're really excited about this because it gives you that option. Sometimes we don't have quarters on us and uh, we just have a credit card or a debit card and these do accept that. It's pretty neat because you, you still insert the coins if you have coins. But if you uh, want to use a debit card or a credit card, you insert that here, and then you'll just add more or less time to get, you know, if you want 30 minutes or an hour, and if you don't want to do it, you can cancel, and then once you get the time that you want, you just hit OK. It's really simple, and I'll show you now how to use it. So when you first walk up to one of these meters that we're testing, it'll tell you the rate. In this particular area out in Chevy Chase, it's um, $1 per hour for a max stay of two hours. And so you could just insert your coins if you wanted to, or if you wanted to use a debit card or a credit card, I'll show you how that works as well. So you'll just insert it like you would at a gas station or any other place. It'll say remove the card quickly. And then it says please wait while it's taking, you know, checking your card. And then you can add time or lower time. So right now it's set up for uh, an hour, but if I wanted to just stay for 30 minutes, I take it down to 30 minutes, say OK. And then it says please wait while it transmits your credit card information and it is encrypted and PCI compliant so you're perfectly safe to use it and once it tests out or um, sends the transmission for your credit card it'll give you that amount of time that you've just purchased um, for a business person that travels a lot or comes downtown or a salesperson you can get reports on uh, you'll see the credit card transactions on your uh, bank statement it's approved it now and um, it's given us a uh, 30 minutes and it's a nice big screen you can see there and so the enforcement folks know that you've paid for 30 minutes and it'll count down just like any other meter would. Another feature of these meters especially for enforcement is you can see from the street the flashing light this meters paid we still have time left on it and it's flashing a green light so that you can tell it's paid. And this meter is expired you can see the red flashing light. This meter is green friendly and it has a solar panel on the back. We are here at Monte in the Chevy Chase area. Could you tell me your name? I'm Danielle Montague with Monte and I am the president of the Chevy Chase Business Owners Association. And could you tell us a little bit about the new meters? Um, about 90 days ago, uh, the city put in some new meters, uh, standalone meters, to test them out to see how that they would do for the Ch Chevy Chase uh, merchants as well as those visiting the area, and they have been very well received. Uh, people have found that they are very easy to use. They like the fact that they accept uh, credit cards and coins at the, at the meters. Uh, the only downside that we have seen is that they don't accept dollars, but people come into my shop and ask for change, so it's a great way for uh, people visiting the area to be exposed to new businesses. Thank you, Danielle. Well, Tasha, that was a good interview with Danielle Montague, and she had some great things to say about these meters that we're testing. We would really like your input as well, so if you've uh, been able to use these or just have an opinion, there's some out here in the Chevy Chase area, and then we've got a few down on Short Street, and if you haven't tried one out, we'd like you to try it out if you're in the downtown or the Chevy Chase area. Uh, but please give us uh, an email or a phone call. You can email info at lexpark.org.
info at lexpark.org or you could call 231-7275 and just let us know uh, what you think about these new meters. Appreciate you spending a little time with us today and please give us your comments and uh, concerns if you have any. Thank you. with the Downtown Development Authority, and you're watching Only Downtown on GTV3. You're watching Government Channel 3, your award-winning link to the Lexington-Fayette Urban County Government. Watch us online at lexingtonky.gov.